Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of the Battle for Astrakhazi. So today we're with the Nikons. We've decided that engaging Reaper units is probably the best way to go about things, trying to destroy as many of their units as we possibly can. Now what we're trying to do by doing this is gain a lot of favor with the warlords that are around this area, plus with the city of Shendi itself. If we can clean out the Red Reapers, remove this threat from the area, we'll get a lot of favor and hopefully we'll get a lot of help when we're trying to look for the SLDF cache. All right, so we received a dis distress call from a base up here and we're just gonna push forward and hopefully clear out any of the Reaper units around here. Looks like they've taken the base completely over. We gotta, we gotta try to reclaim it. Uh, looks like they've got tur their, the uh, turrets that were here are up and running. Uh, in favor of the Reapers. We've got a mech here, Shadowhawk. So I want to engage these guys, I think, as fast as possible and try to destroy them. Now, uh, as I'm saying that, um, a couple things have changed on the mechs and I want to just kind of quickly show you. So the Griffin is, 2C has been pulled out of service. Um, and what we've done is we moved that build onto the Stormcrow, like I said I was going to do. So Blade has got a much better mech now. Uh, we've got an ER PPC, an ER small laser, LRM-10, and a pair of LRM-5. So it's roughly the same as the um, Shadowhawk 2C build that we have, um, or the, sorry, the Griffin 2C build that we had. Um, but it, it is a little bit better. We've got an additional LRM-10, an additional ER small laser, plus a heck of a lot more armor. Um, we've also got a Beagle, or not a Beagle probe, sorry, an Angel um, ECM suite on this thing. So when our guys are in range, their ECM jamming is going to be reduced by four. So it's within 100 me 120 meters of this mech. So this guy's going to be pretty pivotal. If we can get in there, it'll reduce their sensor checks on us um, and also reduce any ECM jamming on us, which is going to be great. That's what my goal is to try and use this guy as. I wasn't able to get a, a full AMS on this. It does have a bolt-on AMS, um, so that's fine. Plus it's got a good targeting system. Uh, it's got a, a level... It's got the, the one, the Tier 3 uh, or the Mark 3... Um, targeting system that we have in the Griffin. So at long ranges, like, I mean, look at this already. The chances to hit are going to be really, really good. So once again, trying to keep with the, the, the clan mobility slash um, uh, long range firepower builds. That's what I'm kind of doing with this guy. So we're going to move up here first. I don't know what our chance is. Pretty low on the Griffin. I think maybe trying to take out a turret as fast as possible is probably the best thing to do here. Uh, let's get in the trees, though. Not, ex not, ex not. I don't know what to expect from the rest of the stuff around here. So I don't know what else we've got. I know we've got three lances, though. We've got the main lance here at the base, plus two more support lances. Now, it, it does say abandoned, because we're in an abandoned planet. It's a three-and-a-half skull planet. This is a three-and-a-half skull uh, capture base mission. So let's hope this gives us a half-decent challenge here. And I think we're going to go straight up on this guy. I want to try to eliminate the turrets, like I said, as fast as possible. Now, we do have standard and incendiary ammo on this thing. I've only got a limited amount of incendiaries, but I think for this, we're going to switch it up. We do a little bit more damage against the uh, the turret with the incendiary, so we're going to go ahead and do that. And I'm going to Warlord this right off the top. Give us a little bit better chance to hit. I want to max out the damage on this thing, get the tag on it. Beautiful. Plenty of damage. I'm liking that. So the second thing that I got to talk about <laughs> is the Nova. So I ran into a little bit of a problem with the Nova in the uh, uh, in the way of a SRM carrier uh, carrying the SRM six uh, Arians or Arians, whatever they are, the uh, the one the SRMs that do fifteen points damage per missile. Uh, yeah, so. Um, we lost some Artemis ammo. We lost an LRM-20. Um, so I had to rebuild it, kind of basically the same as what it was. It was supposed to be a it was supposed to be a milk run mission, but it didn't turn out to be that. Um, so I got pretty close to what it was. We got the same amount of LRMs on it. Let's get into what is this turret? I don't know. Maybe we'll know better when we get up closer here. So I had to switch. I had to, we lost an L, sorry LRM five and an LRM twenty. We lost or no sorry just the LRM twenty or was it both? I think it was both LRM five and twenty. What is this guy? Cascatel. Oh yeah, that's uh, not boding well. We got Sam ammo, so we'll, we'll be okay, I think. Uh, but not in this guy. 
guy's got a ballistic and two missile. This guy's just got a ballistic, which is most likely going to be a uh, AC-20 or something stupidly ridiculous like that, probably. But I think this is a kill shot here. Probably. I'm going to throw the bolt on fives. Might as well, just to uh, see if we can get this. And let's go ahead and warlord this as well. Get as many hits in this turret as we can. Not that turret. This turret. So yeah, we we lost our whole size. So I replaced the, the 5 and the 20 with a, uh, a 15 and a 10. Replaced all the ammo, replaced all replaced the ER medium laser that we lost as well. Um, I lost a micro laser as well off that thing. It was a pretty bad hit up the side. Um, but the mech didn't go down, which was good. So it still cost us a lot, but we really didn't... Oh, he's running. That's nice. So he's a, he's dead meat. He's a, he's open for business now. So it really wasn't that bad. I mean, it was, but it wasn't. So, I mean, because we're slowly whittling down the clan gear that we've collected off the clan units. And since we're probably going to be facing mostly pirates here, uh, we're probably not going to get a chance to um, reclaim some of that missing clan gear yet. Uh, as much as I want to take this griffin kill, I think we got to kill the turrets. I think the, the turrets are going to give us a real big problem here if we don't. So this gets me out of the way of that turret back there. Let's get into here and see what we can do with this guy. Got to be very careful here. Um... Because we're still running a lot of light units, right? So this guy had a 240 armor. 44% chance. Get these on. We're going to leave it on each E, I think. How much do you need to kill? That's definitely a kill. Um, I, want, I think I want to leave that for the vehicles, though. Let's soften this guy up a little bit. Okay, not bad. Took about half his armor, a little over half his armor. Enjoyable. Yeah, so I also messed up too. Um, the next um, mission with the Dragon's Rejects. I thought I was recording. I started recording like, like uh, just before I, I pressed um, start mission. And I started the mission and I got sidetracked. And then when I sat down to actually do it, I hit record again, turning the recording off. And then when I part, I got part way through and I realized where, what had happened, and I'm like, oh shit. So I just threw the recording on. So the next mission with that guy you're going to see is, um, Jesus Christ, now what do I do? Let's get into here. The next mission you're going to see with that guy is, um, we got a good chance on this Cascatel, but I think I want to pull this down. Um, we're going to have a bit of a preamble at the beginning. Uh, what else do I have on here? Oh yeah, we lost the Hydra ammo on this thing too. Alright, firing. So yeah, it's... Because the mission was actually quite a good mission. And I was kind of disappointed that um, I, missed, I missed out on that part of that recording. Like really, like hardcore disappointed. Because that was a really great mission, and I love it when we I pull off good missions like that, but then don't get the full recording on it. So I'll show you a bit of the highlights of that before we start, like, the next uh, video. So at least you'll see kind of what happened. Um, I know it says we're going to be hot, but we're going to fire the lasers on this thing. I know I said it was going to lead us to the vehicle, but... There we go. Nice. I figured that guy probably had enough, enough to take it out. Beautiful. Two turrets, two turrets down. One to go. We got four left. Turret's going on four, which is good. I want to try and move this mech out of the out of the way of. What the hell was that? That. Um, I better find out what that is fast.
All right, let's get out of range of this turret. It's going to go off. It's going to fire, but let's minimize who it can shoot at here. And we're going to go out to this guy with the SAM ammo because we've got it. Firing. Okay, no laser hit. All right. A few more missile hits. I got seven of them, but that's fine. So, yeah, it's kind of like... Uh, anyway, so the next um, next Dragon Rejects, you'll get a good idea of what uh, what's going on. 27, 33, huh? What if you... Um, 39. Let's get you up here. 30 on this guy. Mm, we won't get a kill on him, but let's just fire... We, like... There's a chance we can bring this guy down. With the vehicles. A small chance. If we hit with the Cloud Buster, let's crank up the machine guns. Hopefully we pen the armor with one of these and then hit the internals with this. No. Alright, well... Let's get into here. Don't have a good chance on this guy, I know that. This one's a little more respectable, so let's fire on this guy. Now that his AMS has already shot its load, I have no idea. We hit a few points for a few points there, but not much. We got the Windigo up and running here. Or it's not the Windigo. <laughs> Windigo has got the uh, Polomus wheeled AP APC up and running here, so actually pretty good chances. Let's get to the back of this uh, Shadowhawk. Maybe we can keep him running away. This plus it's actually helping us split up a little bit here. Alright, not the greatest chances to hit. I'm going to leave him at three because we're going to run out of ammo real fast. But let's just shoot in the back of this guy. Alright. I got some kind of LRM carrier back there. Hunter's taking a pounding already. Oh, was that the turret shooting? Oh, it is. It's an LRM turret. Okay. Don't feel so bad now. Question is, do we capitalize on this? 40% to hit. Ooh, I think we capitalize on that. Okay, we got some eyes on now. Grand Dragon. Valkyrie. That, okay, that's the guy we got to get there. The Helopolis. But I think this Cascatel, I don't think it shot all its missiles yet, has it? Come on. It's fired a few, but not very many. So let's switch... Yeah, we didn't take any... Yeah, let's go this route, I think. Take a shot at this guy. TPC hit. Fair number of missiles hit. Not enough, though. Nope. Not enough. But he is shooting himself. And he sh very well should be. He goes on 18, eh? Okay, Kit Fox... Let's get you out of the visual range of those other guys. Get over here. I gotta find that last turret too. I don't know where the hell last turret is. That's the f oh, there it is right there. Flea, what's this guy? Periphery Pike. Three light rotary rifles. Okay, so that could be bad too. Um, we're really hot. Let's do this and drop some heat and damage this guy's back. Sorry for whoever's in that building, but we are we are trying to save who, whatever's left of you guys from these guys. <laughs> okay, we stripped all the armor off one side. All right, not bad. Got to split up because that Helopolis is like. 
is going to be real nasty as of what we saw back here. It sounded like he's got like a rapid fire or something or other. There's a warrior back here, an archer. Oh, cool. That's the Omni Archer. From what? I, oh, I think that thing's got a pair of Thunderbolts, if I, if I remember correctly. Grand Dragon. AC and some missiles. Okay. Going after the Hunter, eh? I think we stay in the trees. Let's move over here. Let's go after this guy. Hopefully we can bring him down. Hopefully we get no collateral damage. Ah, look like, like a lot of leg hits to me. Nope, a lot of back hits. Just no, and some arm hits. Just no pens, unfortunately. Okay. Gatekeeper on 19, then we got somebody on 17. This guy, what does the Cascatel go? 18. So we gotta go after him now. Try and kill him. Let's try and get a bit of speed. Get into here. I don't know if I want to go with a full load on this guy though. Like, all we need to do is a little bit to the front. So. I don't want to waste too much ammo. So 430. Let's use a LRM 30 on this guy. Being an LRM 50 is difficult, especially when, when the ammo goes so fast, right? Let's hope we get what we want here. Yep, okay. Don't know if that was luck or not. I couldn't see where I was hitting. Couldn't see where I was hitting, but at least they lose some eyes with that thing going down. Yeah, he's still gonna run, eh? You got an Ultra 5? Probably? Can't have that thing lurking. Hmm. How do I want to pivot here? That's a shot at what? The dragon? Grand dragon? Yeah, I don't think so. Um, let's get into position to go after this Goss turret. And we'll just lob some ATMs on this thing. Going to switch over to standard for this, though. I think so, yeah. That's a heavy goss. Yeah, we're not rounding the corner on that thing until we uh, take it out, I think. Well, it's at least we know we can take it out. That's a killing blow for pretty much any of our mechs. A couple of mortars from the flea. All right, buddy. We have a limited amount of LK, so let's go to standard. I want this turret or I want... I don't know what it's going to give us over there. Got to split up. I think we need more evasion too. Let's get into here. Probably shouldn't have sprinted. Um, I think we'll be fine for this particular turn. All right, we got more blips back here. That's the Helop Heloplus, Merkiva, Warrior, and the Archer. That's four, five, six. So we're, there should, unless those two are supporting lots of three each, we're missing two people. 
Let's drop some rounds on this guy. I want to be able to use this side, so we got to get rid of this turret as fast as we can now. It's got to go. It's got to go. I'll deal with indirect fire from the LRM turret. I'm okay with that. All right, Marlin. They've been really going after the hunter here. Let's, um... Let's pull back a bit. And we're going to drop some more missiles on this thing. Before we're out here. Oh, 8.8, .8, that's it. I guess because of the range, probably. 6.9. Just kind of go through the gamut here, 6.9. Fifteen. Fifty-two on this turret. Well, fine. Alright, that's good. I was thinking about not shooting on that one. Because we've only got, like, what, 14 turns of firing with that thing? So I was thinking, ah, maybe I shouldn't shoot, but... I think we should be done before 14 turns. Get into here. Let's start hunting this guy down. Okay, leg shot. That's not bad. Couple machine gun hits. Keep the pressure on that Griffin. Force him behind the building so he can't direct fire us with that AC. Okay, that's not good. Those are probably high explosive Thunderbolt. At least we split up, which is a good thing. Let's get the turret. Or the mech between us and the turret. And we can just shoot straight up on this mech here. Do a lot of damage to him if we can. And firing. Yeah, we shot out some windows. Sorry. Whoever's in there, please duck. So that turret got a direct line of sight on us. Yeah, we had to shoot indirectly? Is that just bad animation or... I don't know. Okay. Um, let me think about this now. I think we want all our missile people going after... This guy's got rotary rotaries and I don't want to be in direct line of sight of him because I was thinking about moving back here and going after this guy but that vehicle with the rotaries is going to cause us an issue if we push like this then that means the turret's got a it's got an issue with minimum minimum range Unless it has dead fire ammo, then we're fucked. We want that in the turret. Like, that's not going to be a kill in the turret. That's what, 30, 60? Let's say we hit everything. 90, 120, 150, plus the dead fire. But we could take this guy down. Come on, target him. There we go. This could be a kill on this guy. Sorry, it's this side that's... So we haven't burrowed through here yet. Ultra 5 is jammed. So if his Ultra 5 is jammed this turn, we go after the turret. I'm going to use the tandems in the turret, though, too. Two engine crits. Good damage. I was hoping for an explosion there, but no such luck. You'd assume, though, in the turrets there'd be case ammo. Or case, um, like case two, if they're relatively modern. If they're smart. Or the ammo storage is buried underground. This guy's the least of my worries right now. Fleeby! They're looking to take that hunter out. We're going to keep backing up with it, though, I think. If they are trying to kill it, and try and take it down, there won't be anything I can do about it. 
But if I keep backing it up, that means they're going to move forward to try and hit it, which will give me better opportunities against them. At least that's the plan. We'll see. Well, that sounded like... That was probably the warrior that fire fired. Man, I really just want to round this corner and blow this thing up. But I have, okay, we have an idea now of how much hit points it does have. Improved heavy gauss rifle. We could probably kill this thing if we do. What does it go on? I have no idea, but it's not going to be before everybody else. Let's go for the kill. I'm going to take this side now. We're going to take this side now. Straight up. We don't... What do we got? Incendiary here? I think it uh, calls for use on this guy. You can see he's on. Beautiful. Tags on. Missiles on. Beautiful. Stripped almost all, almost all of its armor. We'll finish it up. I have no idea how... Like, this is probably, what, a 50 tonner? It's got pretty good armor, though. Maybe a 60 tonner? It's a heavy, so it's got to be at least 60 tons. Valkyrie. LRM 15. Not so worried about that thing. It's pretty accurate, but it doesn't carry very much ammo. It's like eight turns of firing and then it's done for the game. So once it's spent its, uh, its rounds, it's pretty much done. Yep, there we go. And this is the case for overkill, I think. But I'm going to switch to normal ammo. We got a ton of standards, so let's use it up in the turret. There it is. Nice. We own this side now. Can you help out with this other turret? I think. Now, I shouldn't be able to shoot my guy in the back because he's behind the rocks here. But, you know. Hammer this turret. Okay, that's the other turret gone. It's open season on the Shadowhawk now. This is the Valkyrie, right? Okay, yeah. You better run. You got you got no reinforcements, not yet. They really want this guy. I need you to back the fuck up, though. I don't want you dying. Okay, that means his ultra auto cannon became unjammed, which means he's open for business again. Now you don't have a turret. I gotta get you in trees again though. Here I guess. I have no idea where you're, oh, you're... Oh, great. I just moved you in a position where your side is going to be uh, a target. Because that's always good. You know me in directions, though. Um, yeah. Alright, five points. We'll take it. We'll take it. Who's next? Alright, pull cat. Um... Let's not put you in a position to take on those rotaries. Let's move over here, though. Get out of that fire. Split up just a little bit. Ah, uh, drop some ATMs on this guy. Nice. Liking the ATMs on this thing, I think we're just... We need one more ton of ammo in there somehow. What the hell was that? Is it the Merkiva? No. Is it you? No. It's not you. It's gotta be you. Fuck, we gotta do something about that guy. Um. Okay, that's left torso.
That's not good. Not good. It's the FC, so I have no idea. I like such a bad chance to hit. I don't know how he's getting such a good chance on us. Probably because um, that's not bad, and this guy doesn't have a lot of armor, so let's take a shot at him. Probably because they've got forward units, you can see us. Start on that guy. Yeah. Fuck. Well, now the archer's on everybody else. We gotta get up there fast. We gotta get right in their faces real fast. Let's go, Wendigo. We gotta we gotta end these guys down here real quick. Shadowhawk's gotta go away, so please make that happen. Beautiful. Hey Rose, I need your help over here. Not the best targeting, but we're gonna get in here, we're gonna go out to this vehicle. Unless the flea's a better target. 59. No, this guy's a better target. Let's go after this guy and start him off. Yes, beautiful hits. It's such a... I'm just thinking about the... Um, right now I'm thinking about the Angel. And you gotta be within 120 meters for it to help with... Um, against... Yeah, I'll get that damage. Against enemy stealth and stuff, right? And to give them harder sensor checks against you. But then that means you're clustered, which means area of effect weapons. Even if they miss, they're still gonna splash damage everybody. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. Oh, of course you do. I'm still reading enemy contacts, command. You Fuck need to right off. The area before you, can proceed. you need to shut your goddamn mouth or I'm just gonna blow up and kill you. Um. Okay, we need to end these guys now. Oh, shit. Brutus. Wolverine, Rakshasa, fuck me. Hoplite, oh fuck. This guy's gotta go now. Engaging. Oh, you missed with the PPC. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're gonna come out of this so bad. Well, I was expecting a tough fight. I just didn't think it was gonna be this type, this, this tough. Where are you damaged? The side? Far side. Can I get to the far side? I cannot. But I can get to the front, which means there's a chance to hit that side. So we're gonna do that. Let's get on you. Copy that. Ready for orders. Same idea. I want to cool off though. So let's drop. We don't need the flamer. We do need the medium heavy on though. So let's just leave it on. I'm going to go Warlord here. I was going to save it for our next turn against the bigger vehicles. But I think this has got to happen now. The laser missed too. God damn it. Aye, aye. That shit can't happen, guys. That shit can't happen. Um. Yeah, he's got to go. So we. Got, oh wait. Yeah, he's got to go. So we got to. Um, we got to use the missiles. There he goes. Nice. Okay. Reporting vehicle destroyed. So I think um, there's been enough people that have been mentioning about the, the copter sounds. I think um, the Rogue Tech team has lowered the uh, the volume of the copters now because it seems like it's a lot lower. It's a lot less um, rumbly in my headphones. 
I don't think it was the minor change that I made in the file that I that I found. Okay, you back the fuck up. Damage minimal. Yeah, any damage is bad damage at this point though. Wait, what's this guy? That's the Grand Dragon. Um can't fight both guys at the, both sides at the same time so I mean we could pull back and pull up the, the cliff on the other side like back here and keep these guys at range for now because the arty is going to kill us if we don't so let's uh, we rotate Or do we just kill these guys? No, I can't kill these guys now. As much as I want to. Let's see what our chances are back here. We're gonna run out of ammo. We are gonna run out of ammo. I do have some Sam here. Let's use it up on this copter. Maybe we can pull it out of service. How much? It's got, ah, well, let's see how many hits we can get on this thing. Uh, this is just for cooling, right? Minus one recoil chance, jam chance, minus 10% heat generator. We're okay on heat, so. Come on. Not quite enough. We need a win here. It's still, it's 13 against, what, 9? But they've got the heavier mechs. Yeah, you run, you bastard. Shit. Okay, we can get behind here for protection, but we can't, that won't protect us from their artillery. We're gonna have to rush it. That archer's moving forward, which is a good thing. The Holopolis, I don't know. Shit. Yeah, we got it. We can't be near those guys. We got to get up here. Yeah, the Rakshasa. That thing's going to be dangerous as hell. I think that's like 75 tons, isn't it? It is a heavy. That armor, it's got to be around 75. Fuck, they can't target the Nova. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is like... Oh, it could be 80 tons. <sighs> Fuck. Waiting for orders. You know, I was complaining... ...about not, f not finding good competition. Well... ...shouldn't have opened my frickin' mouth. Sprinting. Get as much evasion as we can. Let's try and kill this thing with Sam ammo while we're here. That was a good chance to hit. We're going to take it. Laser hit. Beautiful. Vehicle killed. I mean, it's not much fire support that they have there, but still, it's it's another uh, weapon off the board. Okay, that's good. Hey, watch the paint, pal. The paint job you need to worry about. Okay. Here comes the arty. I want to know what the hell he's using. Once again, it just feels like one of those ridiculous weapons that's just like ridiculous. That makes sense. Alright, good misses there. 
I'm here. I know you're there, but you need to be elsewhere. Got it. Full speed, no target. This guy's a pain in the ass. Let's Roger. try and get rid of him. Okay, one hit, not bad. Alright. We've got to get on the Halopolis, and I don't know how to do that. Commander. I don't know how to get up there to do it because this is all wall. Hopefully he runs out of ammo, that's all I can say. Alright, let's hammer this guy. This thing's got limited ammo too, so we're running out real fast here. Ready for orders. <sighs> we can't run direct fire against these guys, and I can't get to a position where I'm relatively safe here. far as we can go, huh? I can kind of get behind a building, but that's not going to help us. I gotta... If he's got enough movement, he can get, my, get a backstrike on me here. Which means I gotta not drop my instability, I gotta sprint. And even then... Hmm... How are we doing for initiative here? These guys are... this guy's going on 21. Gatekeeper's going before him, Blade Slingshot goes before him. These two guys go on 21. 12 and 13. This guy's on 19. I can't reserve. I can't let this guy go before me. I might regret this. I might regret this. God, such a little chance to hit, too. Uh, we gotta kill this guy, though. Fire. Really? Fucking go home, buddy. Waiting for orders. Just fucking go home. Let's see if we can kill him from behind. Yeah, that guy's... the Rakshasa is almost around that corner. Oh, for Christ's sake, just... target him. Let's kill him. Got a good angle. Beautiful. I hope we can salvage that. I don't really care. Alright, that's eyes off, which is great. They're down to, what, 11? Shit, he's getting into direct fire, too. too. We're in a kill box here, that's the problem, and I can't pull back. I was not counting on that, uh, that, that other lance. That's completely my fault, but... I was just not counting on it. Now, dragons, from what I remember, don't have that amazing of armor. Yeah, this guy's got, like, not a lot. 
So let's go right for the shred on this guy. If we can kill him and pull him down fast, that is going to give us some help here. Strip a bit of armor anyway. Where are you going? Okay, that's good for us. Good for us. The fact that he's closer means we might be able to get around behind him. The thing I'm worried about is this thing. Getting a shot on us. Commander? Get our stability back, get behind these buildings. Get on this guy. Let's drop the heat. Tell me what the Commander? I don't know if we have the juice for this, man. I'm just thinking long term and we don't have the lasers. We're going to be out of ammo, we're not going to have any lasers. Not the best. And I gotta stop. Oh, the ATMs aren't bad. Yeah, we gotta go for it. We got a head hit on him. That's good. I'm your spaniel. Are you? There. Oh, I can't. Oh, really? Okay, that's fine. We're going to highlight the base and hopefully, if we have to bail, we'll have to bail, but I don't want to do it. Yeah, if we can't take this dragon down, I don't know how we're going to take the rest of the guys down. Honestly, we just don't have the firepower for it. The extra four, I mean the rest, we could have done it with, if, fuck me. We, we could have easily done it if, um, they didn't get reinforcements. And I wasn't thinking a three and a half skull was going to be this bad, but what a jump up from a three skull. Light damage, holding firm. So, laser-wise, we got one mech that's laser vomit. Not big laser vomit, but laser vomit. Hopefully you're out of ammo. Unlikely, but hopefully. We got the Cloud Buster with two large lasers. Polymos is going to be down to a flamer. We've got one r set of tandems left. ER large, ER PPC, medium on the Storm Crow. The Cougar might not survive. It's taking a lot of damage. That's the LRM ammo. Our large is on this side, I think, right? Oh, it's the double LRM 15s. Where's the large? Do you not have a large? I'm sure you have a large laser. Where is it? Am I just missing it? C 
CT. Head. It's in the head. Okay, well, at least it's protected relatively. <laughs> uh, unless you bail out, then it's not. Yes, Commander. Oh, Christ. See what I mean, though? We're going to be out of ammo with this guy very shortly. What are we looking at for armor on this thing? See, the Hoplite and the Wolverine we can get back on. It's this guy, the Rakshasa, that... It's going to be a fucking nightmare. And if I do this to give them a target, they're just going to kill this guy. Like, we have okay armor, kind of, left over, but that Rakshasa's got so many lasers that it's just going to blow right through it like it's nothing. We got it. We got a bail. First time in this series, but I, I got I. I have to say I don't think there's really any other choice at this point. How good is our armor on this side? 83. Not enough. I mean, we may get lucky. Four chevrons of evasion. I mean, we'd be better off going here. But then more guys would shoot at us. We'd take less damage. Over, I don't know. I can't get a shot in that. Well, I can get a shot in the dragon from here. Let's try that. Christ. Well, he's panicking. Maybe he'll bail out. Okay, that was the archer. Still got ammo. Yes, Commander. Let's go. Come on. Christ, you can't miss. Yeah, I think we got to bail. I don't think there's not much not much else we can do here. Fuck. There goes the leg. I'm losing weapon systems. Yeah, you're not getting out of here intact. You're done. Five rounds. Okay. Well. Standing by. How do we keep away from these guys for five rounds? I have to move. I need evasion. I can't not move. How much damage these guys can do in five turns is going to be insane. Alright, Warlord it is. I was going to save it for the Rakshasa, but we got to apply as much damage to these guys as we can. Actually, let's Vigilance. Because if we don't, they're going to knock us over and we can't have that. Alright, firing on this guy. Or at least the PPC hit. Maybe it'll scare him off. Reporting minimal damage. Maybe. Right, I think it's the Rakshasa's turn, is it not? Nope. Valkyrie. Was he silent last turn? I can't remember. I don't think so. Yeah. Okay. Cheap kill.
that assault tank is in a good spot. Like, he can just move and shoot us. There's not a damn thing I can do about it. Like, if I stay behind a building, which is what I try to do with this guy, he still might be able to sneak a shot in on me. And I guess if I move up here, it's probably better. That gives those guys a shot on me. Hmm. This is not good. Um. I can't see any of their move right now. Let's do this. Alright, do what we can against this guy. Roger that. No idea where that guy's armor is put. He's maneuvered into a really good spot. Yes, Commander. He's in a really fucking good spot. If I go this way, I, I open myself up to atta the attack from the tank. And it's already one shot one of my guys, so we have to face these guys. Do I try and kill the dragon, or do we just take pot shots at this guy? It's worse shots on the dragon. Either way, I'm exposing something. Let's go after the dragon. Ah, it's not so good. Uh, actually, that's vigilance. Because hopefully that'll give us initiative next turn. And we're going to drop the two ERs off this to get our heat back so we can get the hell out of here next turn, hopefully. Roger that. Come on, give me a head hit. No. Nope. What the fuck is he using? It's the archer that's got those weapons. What the hell is it? Awaiting orders. Oh, you know what it is? It's air burst. You dirty bastard. He's using fucking air burst on me. That's what it is. I think we go for the damage where we can get it. Firing on target. Sure, whatever. Whatever. It's our first, first solid defeat. I mean, it is the Reapers, so... Hang in there, buddy. Hang in there. Reporting major armor lock. Yeah, I may have to, like sacrifice my two vehicles here to try and get out of here. This is only the first turn. Reporting. Minimal damage. Yeah, looking back, if I knew those guys were going to drop, I would never have pushed this side out or gone up this way. But hindsight's always 20-20. There's not much I can do about it now. I can't get into any trees. 
I can force indirect fire on this side. Let's walk over here. That's all I can do. They're gonna they're gonna take this guy down too. There's not a damn thing I can do about it. Well, at least he took some damage. Maybe he'll run. Yeah, maybe not. A Helopolis didn't even shoot. Waiting for orders. I hate doing this. I hate doing this. But we gotta give him a target. Gotta give him a target. Okay, that's good. I can't take much more of this. You have to, you got no choice. Waiting for orders. You got no choice. Acknowledge. Come on, Bubba. You gotta do this. Acknowledge. Fuck. Really missed them both. Well. Looks like these guys may have to go back into the rebuild mode. Wow. Commander. You're in melee range, huh? I think we're going to get a lot of damage on these guys, but... We can kind of get to a position where they can't... ...target us. If they move, they'll be able to hit me here. Probably here, too. That is like the worst. That's... Oh man, I don't really have anywhere to go. It's totally a speed thing here. Um... Dropships bound to this location. Well, what the hell does, good does that do me? If you land now, that would be great. Any help would be good. You could try and hide behind the rock, then this guy just comes around the corner and kills me. Well. Let's hope we get lucky here. Let's hope they don't. They, let's hope they can't target me here. Let's hope they can't. Engaging. Orders. How far can you get? Same problem. But better 
in terms of angling, they got line of sight on you here. Well, not much I can do. Let's go direct on this guy. I need the heat for next turn. Or else we're not going anywhere. Yeah, those reinforcements, I don't know. We got we still got like this is like <laughs> the second round. We got three more to go after this. We got missiles, huh? Yep. Damage. Yeah, just hold on. Can't take much more of this. Ah, <laughs> uh, kind of sums up my day, the day I've been having. So he's probably, I don't know if he's out of ammo or if he's jammed. At least that guy's running as an LRM boat. Stay out of fire. Back up here. Get some stability back. Target the dragon. Yeah, we lost heat sink, so there's not much I can do about this. Beautiful. Yeah, I'll take that. Commander. I can't see that other guy. Oh, yes, I can. He just can't see me right now, so we're gonna back up to here. We got we got a line of sight on the archer. With an ER medium laser in it. <laughs> That's it. It's not going to help us, is it? This might. Let's go with HE. Target confirmed. Sure. Who's up? Commander. Let's get over here. We are in trying to keep ourselves alive, mo alive mode here. Leave the flamer off, drop a little bit of heat. Okay, we pen the armor somewhere. Reporting critical hit. LRM 15 crit. All right, that will hopefully help him to not hit us. Yeah, he must be out of. Um, he must be out of ammo. Either that or he's got a direct fire weapon. I wonder if he's got the short range thumper. Ow. Still got the cloud buster left and the polymost to go. I think we push these guys here on this side. Yeah, you're gonna you're shooting that guy. Who's next? Ready for orders. So this is the left side. Mm. 
not the ultimate, but might buy us a turn. Okay, shooting this guy. Wow. Four points. Yeah, it's got to be airburst. It's got to be airburst. I'm receiving you. So that's the right side. You've got the most armor on. So if we pull this way, that'll give us the maximum amount of protection. We can target this guy. And hopefully get lucky on this. Affirmative. Nope. Got a hit though, so that's important. If we can get that guy down, and they have less direct line of sight on us, I'll feel a lot better. Hang in there, dude. Just like one more turn. Okay, now, who's up? Receiving you. Get over here. You got more armor than anybody, so let's see if we can get lucky and pull this guy down. Nice. Can go down. So they're down to seven. Okay, he's not doing anything. Aye, aye. Why is that? Okay, we gotta turn our left side to the archer. Fuck, does that mean these guys... that's indirect. Well, we got good back armor, relatively, compared to what we've got left in the front, so maybe it's okay doing that. Take pot shots on this guy. Yeah, we see you, you fucker. Still shooting you. Let's drop some heat. Hmm, I feel... You know what, I think... That's the... That's that one side. Get up here. I thought we had a line, better line of sight on this guy. Wait, what? I got my control burst. It's ten percent less. I got no heat sinking. That's why. Aye, aye. Not a damn thing I can do about it either. Alright, let's see what we can shoot at that guy. A pair of ERs, we're gonna go ahead and use them. Get a head hit, please. Ah, tag's on. It'd be beautiful if we could get a head hit on this guy. Just screw up his ability to target me. Yeah. Up pretty good. You are. We're trying to get you out of there. Just hang on. I think the Polomos is pretty much done, but you might get out of there. Oh, he's hot too. I'm ready. Don't have incendiaries. That's the Helopolis. That's the Archer. Location confirmed. They don't push forward. We might be okay here. Oh yeah, it's pretty good range. Pretty good target, or uh, target. pretty good chance to hit for that range. Don't think we can get that guy to run, though, unfortunately. 
What are you up to, you fucker? Okay. Armor breach. Internal damage. Yeah, your your whole thing is an armor breach. What are you talking about? That's the Merkiva. If I can get you around behind this hill. Who did you shoot for? The Adder. So we got the two. No, he's got something else. Well, that was that was very fortunate. He must have something. Uh, he's got to have the two. He's got some kind of ballistic. It could be a mortar with airburst. And these are the two uh, thunderbolts. I know these are thunderbolts. At least it's jammed this turn. Orders. Or reloading, whatever it's doing. Fuck me. Reveal a little bit more of the back armor. Ooh, not too much though, because I don't want him hitting the other side. Let's get into there. This guy's dead, but at least we can get a shot in the back of the Wolverine. SRMs are almost out. By. How are you doing? Front armor's down, but everything else seems to be okay. Can't get to the back of that at Wolverine, eh? So hoping we could get at least get a shot at it, but you know what? This might not be a bad move. That rack shaft is super heated. If we can get him to shoot for this guy and burn himself up, then we don't have to worry about uh, worry about him for the next two turns. I think. All right. And if we get lucky and he shuts down, I might be able to kill him. Commander. So that archer's moved to a position where we can't... Oh, come on. Or has he? He has not. All right. That's not. Oh, we're gonna warlord this too. All right. Let's hope we get some good hits here. Okay, PPC's on. At least his senses are impaired. Hopefully that'll help a little bit. Just shoot for somebody with an AMS. That guy was pretty accurate. He'd been doing nothing up until then. Okay, we need to make sure our right side is towards the archer. Moving to position. Probably not the best place to be, but we gotta shoot at this guy. Firing. Maybe we get lucky and get that torso. Like with everybody. Shit. Burn up, you fucker. I'm losing weapon system.
Uh, he might shut down next turn. Standing by. Move order received. Get back on that archer again. They may have stopped shooting for our guys back here because the uh, storm crows here now. They might be fucking up all their sensors. Waiting for orders. Is there a way you can target the archer? There is from here. Don't miss. Location confirmed. You shoot us, I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, we got the tag on. Beauty. It's really what we wanted. That's a back shot in that guy. He's just asking me to do it. But I can't. Because I don't have the heat sinking. Or do I? I'm okay. Well, relatively okay. Let's, oh, he's got a handheld rack too. Well, how the fuck does that work? Because if he can't see me, how's he shooting me with it? Like the, the times that he was using it, he didn't have a direct line of sight. Unless I was thinking, unless maybe it was a Holopolis that was using it, and he's using it now. Could very well be. A whole lot of twos, but at least we're applying a lot of damage to him. Yeah, you run, you fucker. Oh, he hit me directly with one. At least it was on the uh, on the strong side. Oh, he got me in the CT though. Ow. No. Hang in there, buddy. Don't fall. Merkiba's gonna target me and knock me over, you watch. Or he'll kill me, one of the two. Here it comes. Well, that's kind of a bonus. Losing armor. Yeah, I think I'm thinking that the Stormcrow being back here Receiving you. is really helping out. Yeah, you're gonna die going through the fire. If you move, you're dead. Well, we got four rounds left of everything, so let's just burn it up here. Yep. They're flanking. Yeah, nothing you can do about it. Yeah. If I had moved out of there and took heat damage, they'd just killed me anyway. Alright, we got this is the last turn. That Brutus is going to get a shot at us if I don't uh, get to a position where he can't see me, kind of. This is the guy we want. Let's go after him. PPC hit. Depend. Probably got that far torso. We might be able to pull this guy down. Shit. Don't fall over. Yes, Commander. Guy still hasn't shut down. Affirmative. Shoot what you got. Fuck. Oh well. Negative damage. Repeat. Negative damage. Standing by. 
Okay, we got to keep your right side. This way. Affirmative. Shit. Me and my fucking directions. God damn it. I can hear you all laughing out there. We'll go. Come on, we gotta get lucky on this guy and kill him. It'll be so worth it losing what I did just to kill that guy. Yep. Yeah. Fuck. There's not a damn thing I can do about that. We're down a mess. I'm receiving you. Alright, last on chance way. on that archer. Just get lucky, please. Target confirmed. Saw a couple pieces of red, but that's it. Inflicted some heavy damage. Damn it. Rekeeper still got LRMs. This guy's got his missiles. Taking heavy hits, Commander. I saw that. Brutus has still got to go too. Well, at least you went for a fully armored guy. There it is. Get out of here. Retreat. Well, the Reapers are definitely going to be able to push push their advantage now. We may not make our financial report, which could be bad. So, what do we lose off the Nova? Everything in the head, which is bad. Uh, we lost the other clan LRM twenty. I've got a fifteen and I think a ten left, or a, maybe it's just a ten. I don't know what we're going to do with this guy. I think we need to start to switch over to energy builds again. I don't know how I'm going to heat sink at all, but we're going to try that. So storm crows, okay. Adders, okay. And we do have mechs that, I mean, I'm bringing forward the, Gren the uh, Grendel now too, right? So, and we got we still got the Griffin sitting there. We can put some stuff together. I'm not that worried about it. Uh, you went down. All the double heat sinks lost. Um, the arm Omnipod lost. Uh, what else did we lose on this thing? ER large we maintained, but we lost the two LRM 15s, did we not? One LRM, we lost them both, yeah. And on this guy, the ATM 6 we lost. At least we didn't lose the ammo though, so that's okay. Alright. And of course they're gonna like, <laughs> we're gonna get dis disputed salvage. So Cascatel, I don't really give a shit about Valkyrie. They'll give us eight endo steels and four rotary. Yeah, I would, I'll just accept this because uh, I can't afford to. Um, I can't afford to pay for that. Ninety-three thousand. Forget that. Salvage assigned. No, no, no sell. Wait, it said we, if we left, we would be in in good faith. So we got nothing, eh? All right, well, we're going to have to spend a lot of time getting stuff fixed up here. Got the Grendel coming forward. I'm probably going to have to. Well, we Yeah, we can make our we can make an A financial report in 16 days. What can I get up and running by then? I'm going to reorder things. We got a lot of mech pit. pilots out. So, Stormcrow, Adder, Kit Fox are good. I can probably get a I mean, the vehicles are all good. The Cougar, both the Cougar and the Kit Fox, I think, could probably be fast rebuilds. I mean, they'll all be fast because they're all Omnis, right? Yeah. Let me think about it. We don't. We're not going to have an LRM build anymore. I do. I do think we do need some kind of indirect build, though. 
So maybe we have we I pull the, what LR, whatever LRMs I got left and drop them on one mech. So maybe the Nova stays as the LRM mech. Although I don't have an Artemis system, plus all my Artemis ammo I think is gone now. Um, let me think about it. We're gonna have to re definitely rejiggy stuff here. We got plenty of mechs. So, I mean, what's our engineering si situation like? Do we have? Can we get another six hundred thousand? Okay. I'm on the wrong planet for that. I gotta get off of this planet first. So we're gonna need to go to a lower skull planet. Well, I mean, we're still on Astrakhan, quote unquote. We we'll have to go to a lower skull area to do some damage, to get our financial report and get some gear back. Let me think about where this is going to take this part of the series, though, because that's that was that was a significant blow. But I, I think I needed that battle. I think I needed that. You know, we're okay at three skull, but four skull is going to be or three and a half is going to be tricky. Four is going to be even worse. So, I think the dragons rejects though. I think they may have fared fairly well in that. The fact that they've got a lot of heavier like heavier armor, I think would have would have been good. Yeah, it's interesting. Anyway, I gotta leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.